Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, hope you guys are doing well. Okay, it's me again, Mr. Patrick. First of all, do me a favor, please, I'd like you to share, like and subscribe to this channel. Okay, I'll be talking about the police um, and a foreigner by the name of Ichi Boots. Let's roll the intro. Welcome back. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Hope you guys are doing well. Okay, there was um, a national, international embarrassment that happened um, the other day by a lady who went. Uh, by the way, she's a rider. She rides bike around the world. I think this is her seventh edition or so um, episode. Put it that way. Um, so he, she, you know, um, rides around um, um, Europe, South America, and other countries. So she was in Africa. By the way, that's a good um, you know way of spending your time, you know, um, because um, in the Western world, you know, some in Africa with our mentality to be asked, why is she riding everywhere? Uh, but some of them, they they are not, you know, um, they are not into, they are not crazy about wealth, just like um, we, the black people. Yeah, the little they have is enough for them. So anyway, um, that'll be another discussion sometime. Anyway, so this lady decided to wear she found her way in nigeria i'll put up the video there anyway just have a watch how are you hello hello how is everything everything is fine from where netherlands yeah? netherlands there you go what do you bring up <laughs> see the that eh? oh you give me a little where they go abuja Abuja! Abuja! How are you? Give me something now. Oh, it's everything. Everything is fine. Huh? How's family? Good. Family is good. <laughs> this water. Yeah. Me, me, yeah, what do you like... bring? Wait till you bring home. Huh? Wait till, wait till you bring home. I say wait till you bring home. Wait till you won't give me. <laughs> hey. Wait till now, wait till you won't give me. Oh yeah, give me something. Oh yeah, give me something now. Huh? Give me uh, something. <laughs> you give me something. <laughs> give me money. Money, money, money. Why? Why? <laughs> okay, okay, bye bye. <laughs> okay, so the lady as she was riding, enjoying herself, just as usual, she was stopped on the road. Look at the policemen, how they rushed out. You know, rushed out with their with their you know um, useless sticks. Anyway, they stopped the lady, and if you have if you've watched the video, you could see their behavior sums it all. You know that many of our so-called policemen are are untrained. They are cruel. They are they are unpolished and um, it's quite is a sad is a sad tale put it that way that um, up until now you know our security guys behaves like um, you know um, you know people that have have got no training okay so you see the police forces um, the security forces are you know sometimes not sometimes many of them are untrained um, you know, it's like it's like the training um, is inadequate if they are if they are being trained at all. You know, look at how they embarrass themselves. 
and then you know the the ig of police i think uh yeah one of the uh guys there said um you know they were they are going to investigate and unfortunately for these guys you know they'll be punished um but i wanted to i wanted to get something here because even the so-called leaders um they are superiors that's how many of them that was the the route or route they took um they were on the roads extorting money you know until they got promotions and um, you know uh, made their way to the office so in, i'm not trying to you know absorb what these guys did but you know we should not be surprised because many of the so-called policemen with badges that's how they started you know because the system has allowed them to display you know their 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 you know the, the system allows them to display their own professionalism and then we see it today okay so now we just want to point something out the the, the policemen uh, you know rushed out and you could see when they saw the ladies gadget they were amazed they were shell-shocked they were bamboozled they were you know and look at how they were you know they didn't even know that the woman was recording them you know and look at their behavior the way they, their expression you know it shows you know these guys are not serious people unfortunately we know that in the system they are they are not paid well so in most cases they will have to you know um, um, get themselves on the road and um, display these behaviors in order to get extra cash to support their families many of these policemen have not been paid for months some are some are being owed and if some of them for example you know if they have an accident you know they are simply just ignored so i'm not trying to absorb what they did but it shows that the system is rotten the nigerian system is rotten we saw the other day that a military man you know bought a house in america that's the system for you because the policemen they go on the road some of these policemen are, are in the in the night they turn from government um, enforcer to armed robbers the soldiers we've heard that some of them you know engage in kidnappings after their official duty they switch over to unofficial duty okay but in some sort even the ig the other day on um, cop 28 that the ig was in dubai about green initiatives that's how they rule that's how the system you know the system allows such um, impunity okay the system allows such impunity so anyway it's a disgrace that um, our niger we know the nigerian system is corrupt and we know that the police they are corrupt people by the way they are good policemen and women out there doing their best but when you try to be good and the system fails you you know they some of them have no option they, they've been pushed put this way the system pushes them you know pushes them to behave like these guys anyway please like share and subscribe to our channel and i will see you on the other side peace